This is a short video detailing the Samazi Mac hardware failure and a possible fix. So one day you're ready to do some work on your SE30 when suddenly there's no boot chime and you've got a bunch of black and white horizontal lines on the screen. You tap the side but nothing happens. This phenomenon was named Samazi Mac by the Japanese and is often simply the result of a dirty motherboard. Now I'm not talking about dust, I'm talking about an oil that leaks out of those old button-shaped capacitors. This film of oil on the motherboard interferes with the flow of electricity in the board. Now here you can see the oil on a Mac 2 motherboard. It's featured in uh, my Mac 2 video. Now this is the Mac 2 that gave me an error cord when I tried to jump start it. So first, remove the board from the computer. Simple as that, huh? Take away the ROM chip, the battery, and the RAM being careful not to damage the holders. Now get some tap water and add a few drops of dish soap. Now drop the motherboard in. I know it seems like the last thing you'd want to do. Get a toothbrush, put some soap on it, and scrub around the board to remove the oil. After that's done, remove the board from the water and rinse it completely with distilled water. Now leave it to dry, preferably in the hot sun for a few hours or until all traces of water are gone. Now after this treatment, the Mac 2X booted up fine. However, with the SE30 it made no difference. So probably the capacitor leakage is too far gone and I'd have to solder in new capacitors another day. Now bear in mind this technique may cause more damage to the board. So do this at your own risk. Thank you for watching and let me know if you have any questions.